In the 1960s, if you made a film, it tended to be uh, quick little shots of this and that. And this film starts with a quick shot of a descent into Guernsey, looking over the engine. There's a dark Rolls-Royce turboprop, uh, or Rolls-Royce Dart turboprop, as we come into Guernsey. Guernsey and the Channel Islands. Then we see the rocks at Grand Rocks with... Uh, I've still got those knees uh, and my sister in an anorak because this is a British holiday in summer, so it was cold. Uh, rocks seemed to go on forever when I was a little lad. Sister with my mother walking on the seawall. And look at that lovely old bus. Beautiful blue sea, pink granite, waves breaking over the rocks. My dad loved waves breaking over the rocks and filmed quite a lot of them. Uh, I think that's going to be Grand Rock still on the west coast of Guernsey. Perhaps a viewer will correct us if we got that wrong. St Peter Port, the main harbour of Guernsey. This is before the marina was built. Uh, one of the Herm ferries setting out from the, the quayside. He was always very conscious of where the sun was. You couldn't film into the sun. Not, not with that camera. That, I think, is Langcress, a beach at the north of Guernsey. Acres of beautiful sand. Uh, is it Langcress or is it Vazon? That's my sister's backside. Oh, well. Running on the beach. Running down to the beach. Hey, I'm pretty sure that's Langcress. As I say, someone will correct me if I got it wrong, and I think that's Pembroke Bay in the background. The tall towers are Martello towers. They were built by the British to defend the islands against the French. That's me, bucket and spade, off to do some damage to some sandcastles or something. Now I've got a feeling that's my mother in the water with my sister. Very unusual for Mum to get wet, but uh, now and then she did. Bathing caps keep the salt out of your hair. And yep, yeah, there I am, wind cheater. Look at those knees. Still got those knees. Me and my mother walking on Langcrest Common. Again, this is the north part of Guernsey. That looks like Kobo Bay, I think. There's a fantastic fish and chip shop there. I say that, haven't been there for a few years. I suppose it's still there. Again, waves running in.